skies, no diamonds in skies And I did all for you, cause you wanted me to Hi beauties, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me, welcome back. Today I thought I would do a different kind of get ready with me. It's basically uh, my skincare routine that I do in the morning and I might incorporate uh, the evening skincare routine and put them kind of together. So if you guys are interested in seeing what my skincare routine is every day, then keep on watching. Okay, so I thought I would go ahead and do a little different get ready with me. Basically, in the morning when I first uh, cleanse my face and everything, and then later um, come back on and uh, see me remove maybe my makeup that I'm wearing for the day or anything like that, what I do at nighttime. Now, the only thing is, is I'm not a stickler. Like, I, I rotate everywhere, every which way. And... For me, it depends on what my skin needs that day. As I mentioned before, I have combination to dry skin. And this time of the year, my skin gets very dry and I do need a lot of things that's gonna keep my skin hydrated. Summertime, it's a combination. I can get the oiliness in the T-zone and mostly like some dryness maybe around the cheeks in different places. There's times where I'll use one of my skin polishers that I got from Abaji. Um, I do have like a face scrub that I got. Um, I had shown before. It's an almond honey. I think it's almond honey um, from the Queen Helene. And just, you know, different things like that. So if that day I feel like I want a more uh, face scrub, I'll do that. Then there's days where I'll just use a basic cleanser and I have my Neutrogena uh, Hydro. Hydro Boost, Brie, um, Genesis uh, Hydrating Gel Cleanser, or the Soap and Glory Vitamin C uh, Detox. And um, a day like today, I want to use the Body Shop Drops of Youth uh, Youth Liquid Peel. This is one of them, uh, like ganache uh, kind of type cleanser or a peel where it's a gel substance and you'll put it on your face and massage it all around. And you'll see little like pieces of your skin on on your on your face as you're doing this so it's like removing all the dead layers of skin that you have and kind of giving you your nice new fresh skin um, below from it and these are really nice and here is what it looks like it's like a gel type substance um, and I have natural light today, plus my light on, so hopefully that helps. But you just rub it along, and you'll start seeing, which today feels like a day where I have quite a few. Can you already see? Like, look, look right there. See that? The sun's kind of glaring. But you could probably see... On my skin the layers of the, the or you could probably see my skin and it's the craziest thing but it it's great because it feels very refreshing I'm telling you what when you do that my skin feels so soft it feels it feels really nice um, today I'm gonna use my Hydro Boost Hydrating Cleansing Gel from Neutrogena. I just got this and I've been using it and it's really nice. It does have, um, it says it boosts hydration for soft, supple skin, effect effectively removes makeup and impurities, and it has like the hyaluronic acid. So that's what I'm going to do because I cleanse my face after I do the peel. So we're going to go ahead and do, do that. Wash that all off, and boy, does it feel nice. My skin feels really, really nice right now. And I was also going to say that uh, those cleansing pads that I had shown to the Vino ones, sometimes I'll use those in the morning. Now, for days that I'm going to mask, which I'm not going to do today, 
usually what I'll do if I use one of my body shop masks or any other kind of mask, like a clay mask of some sort or anything, I'll put that on first and then rinse it off and then use like a cleansing, like one of my cleansers or something like that, just a basic cleanser. Um, or certain days I'll do a sheet mask and I'll use one of my basic cleansers or whatever kind of cleanser I'm going to be using, maybe even one of the scrubs. And then I'll put the um, sheet mask on because a lot of them have like a serum based substance on it. So those ones I don't obviously rinse off. The next thing is I'll, I'm going to go ahead and do the e.l.f. lip scrub thing because uh, I definitely feel like my lips need it. Um, and I don't do it every day. I do it sometimes like every other day or a couple days. But today I'm going to do it because I feel like it needs it. Just wipe off a little bit of the excess if I have any. Okay, I'm going to use this toner here that I have, the Bulgarian Rose Water, this stuff here. This is from the Tammy Fender. This was sent to me. I mean, I am really liking it because I love anything with rose. Uh, some days I'll use this, and some other days I will use the Mario Bdescu, um rose spray that I have. I use one of the little cotton pads like this that I got and just rub along. It feels great. I can't explain it. It's, you know, I mean like toners back in the day I, I remember using and a lot of them, a lot of them could have alcohol in them and I don't want that. The next thing I do, now today, once in a while I'll use just one of these. Or sometimes I combine these two together and I really like both of them. Now this one here I purchased at TJ Maxx and it's the Lanolin Rose Hip Oil Skin Renew Firming Serum. There it is. I love this stuff. It's a little bit tacky when you first put it on but I am loving it and I do a couple pumps and it's like a gel, like a little bit of a gel substance. So that's the first one I'll put on. Sometimes I'll just do this one which I do dab it all around and then kind of work it in. And the other one I use is the Revive Serums HA 7X 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 HA 7X Multimolecular uh, Hydrator Serum. And this is compared to Skin Medical HA5 Rejuvenating Hydrator. I've never tried the um, Skin Medical Skin Medica. I'm sorry, Skin Medica. I've never tried it. This was sent to me to do a review on, you know, give my thoughts and review and all that kind of stuff. But I really like this. This is, this works. This does give me um, the plumping effect that I was looking for. And it's just a very hydrating serum. So that's what it looks like. So this one's a tacky one too, but Put that all over. Oops, sorry about the camera. So let that dry and do its thing. I'm going to go ahead and put my lip balm on. And just to get my lips nice and moisturized. The eye product I'm going to use today is, this is the Oils of Life from the Body Shop. And it's a an eye, like an eye gel, and it looks really cool. It look, has a beautiful goldeny, luminous color to it. Now here's the thing. All right, the company Gold Elements sent me products, and the one, the products that stood out to me the most were the eye products, but they're very pricey. They're, and the one was like an eye serum which I still have them, I still use them. One was an eye serum and the other was an eye cream and you use them as a combination. And, and, it, and it's effective, it works, it does work. But the biggest place that shocked me the most, and I have to give it credit to the gold elements because I feel like that's what kicked it in gear, was my lips. I had them fine lines along my lips and they were really noticeable. They're pretty much gone, like literally gone. Like, and I've always put my eye cream there, always. This product here from the Body Shop, the um, it reminds me of the eye serum that came from the Gold Elements. You know, like the there's like this luminous goldenness to it, and it just kind of reminds me of it. So I dabbed on both my 
uh, fingers here and I'm going to go ahead and uh, dot some there and this is when I dot a little bit there and then I go up and around and this goes to credit to Miss Swoozy if anybody watches her and that dries pretty quick and then on my lip I just go around here then oh okay so then speaking of abaji the zo health uh, essential daily power defense anti-aging this stuff is great now i use it mostly during the daytime uh, but again i'll switch it up i'll use this sometimes um, i'll use my Val valentia uh, moisturizer that i have i really like that one and i do use my retinol cream which i'm going to put on top of this sometimes I do do that and I'll do like maybe a couple pumps on my hand there like pump and a half maybe mmm has that citrus scent I love it and this feels great it's really soothing and just ugh. now sadly my pump don't work but this is the advanced clinicals which I did get this in my Walmart and I haven't seen it since and I know a couple of people were asking me I, I do see it on Amazon and I do see that you can order it online from Walmart um, but for some crazy reason it's not there anymore but I have to open mine up like this because sadly my pump don't work now that's one thing I've seen from a couple other people with theirs when I seen the reviews for this now I do get a nice glob but the reason why I do is I work it along down my neck and everything because what I do with this is I just do a little bit of a pat and then the rest I kind of work here and along my ears I work all the way down to my decollete there we go that is pretty much my morning time skincare routine I will be back later and we'll do my nighttime routine okay so I am back now I'm going to show you what I do in the evening time when I'm cleansing my face now today I did put on some makeup because well for when I was trying out some products and playing around and also I wanted to show you guys what I do do what I do do <laughs> that always sounds funny to me when I say that but what I do when I'm taking off my makeup there's different ways again that I do it because it's going to depend on if I wore makeup or not, uh, my skin, what my skin needs for that evening. I really try to hydrate my skin at night especially because uh, you know like when you're sleeping your skin goes through different um, different things and it's a little more vulnerable so um, I try to keep it very well hydrated even in the summertime if I wasn't wearing makeup, I would probably just use one of the basic cl cleansers that you've seen uh, earlier, like I used the Hydro Boost, um, the Vitamin C, or um, the Brie. Today I have on makeup and, you know, I was playing around with makeup. So the first thing I'm going to do is I use my uh, Garnier Skin Acti Active, the micellar, the micellar water. Now I use the one with the blue cap. This is uh, all in one removes makeup. It's for um, all skin types, even sensitive. I think this one's supposed to be. It doesn't say it on here though. Hmm. I don't know. I think the blue one's supposed to be help to remove uh, waterproof makeup. You know, if you have something like waterproof. And, you know, it varies for me. Sometimes I do wear waterproof. So I just get it just to, you know, for the sake of it so shake it up first so i usually put it on my eye first and pat around on it and i kind of open up my eye and just you know leave it on there for a few moments and then i'm going to go on the other side but you could probably see how much already it came off and very gently pat and pat here I don't want to tug too hard get my ears because of course 
we work makeup all over the place on the ears and everywhere <laughs> that look how dirty like really that's insane but yeah and then I'm going to put a radiant facial cleanser with royal jelly this is with the jojoba beads and fruit ec extracts this is the um the compared to the Burt's Bees I wouldn't mind trying the Burt's Bees it looks like a milky substance so I'm going to use that next and that you can use around your eyes I might actually repurchase that because I do find it's very effective for cleaning off the makeup. So I got that cleanser off and it does, it really makes your skin feel very nice, very soft. Now tonight I'm going to do a mask. I feel like doing a mask and I am going to use the Body Shop Himalayan Charcoal Purifying Glow Mask. I'm going to use this one here. I've shown this many times. And you know, yeah, they have sent it to me, but I really love this because it is so comparable to the, um, you know, the glow mask. And I just rub it, or well, you know, put it along on my face here. It's comparable to, um, you know, the all famous what is that? Glam glow. I can never think of it. Why? Uh, it's the only thing is my hair. I think this is the one I'll have to be getting more of because it's the one I use a good bit, but for $30, yes. Because compared to Glow Mask and how much Glow Mask is, yeah, I would repurchase this. I think my husband's gonna use this. Me and him do our skincare kind of together. Of course, he's not gonna be on camera though. Are you gonna use this, honey? Yeah, see, he, he likes to use it too, so. Uh, so yeah, let me be back here. And I'm gonna take this into him because he will not come in here. Or maybe he will, maybe he will come in here. Yeah, but not going on the camera. No, you won't go on the camera, but here. You can hear me, but you're not gonna see me though. <laughs> you can hear him, but you won't see him. But I gotta wash my hands anyway, so. But as you can see, like it's already drying up. And everything compared to what you just saw me a bit ago so it does it does dry up pretty good I usually leave it on about 10 maybe 15 minutes which I'm not gonna leave you on here that long watching me have it on so I did uh, rinse it off and everything again my skin feels nice and smooth so my next step will be I'm gonna go ahead and again I'm gonna use the Bulgarian rose water. I'm going to use some more of this to use as my toner. So wipe this along again. Okay. All right. The next step I'm going to do is I'm going to actually use my HA7X. This stuff here I used earlier on my face, the serum, I'm going to put that on, which like I said, it's like kind of a tacky product or something like that. So, um, with my face feeling just a little bit still wet, it kind of helps it spread a little bit better. And I'm going to use my uh, eye cream. This is from the Zo Skin Health. It's the Illuminate Intensive Eye Repair Anti-Aging Formula. I apologize, you can't see that no matter how much I try to put it through. But it's a very thick, like, balm eye cream. Let's get a little bit on my finger and everything. And put it through the two fingers and work along the eyes. I put along on my lips like I do and then like I said I like to massage around. And I do circular. The next product I'm going to use is also from the Zo Skin Health. This is the Essential Growth Factor Serum Plus. Oh my goodness, I love this stuff. Which set? Okay, you can see that a little bit better. 
and it's kind of funny because it's like a mirror reflect product you would think not but it's that one that comes out through this pump here so you push on it push down on it and get the product out and this is what the uh, substance looks like it's like a, a very thick serum but it's very smoothing I can't explain it it's only for nighttime it even I think says on there it's for nighttime so I put this on and boy does it feel your your skin and your face will love you for it because it feels very soothing almost like a spa feeling <laughs> like you it just it feels really good <laughs> the last thing i'm going to put on is this is one of the items that i got in my tj maxx and it's from the lana cream this is the uh, reviving night cream uh, New Zealand Manuka honey. I can see a little bit, but I got mine in TJ Maxx and you can get, I think like the day cream and eye cream and all that kind of stuff, which in my drawer, as you can see, I am like getting down to the nitty gritty. But the crazy thing is, is this is like a gel moisturizer and I just pat it on first and then I work it down along my neck and decollete and all that great stuff and that is pretty much it I will be putting on a lip balm for this evening I don't have one with me right now all right beauties thank you so much for joining me I really appreciate that if you did like this video please give me a thumbs up that would help me out so much and I'd appreciate that very much also you can click the subscribe button down below and you can join me each week but do not forget to also hit the bell button that's right next to it because that will inform you of when my new videos are up if you'd like to continue watching my videos and as always beauties please remember to be yourself love yourself and let the real beauty shine through so until the next time you take care I will see you then. Love you guys. Bye.